is the UAZ SPG-9 worth it? Probably not. <laughs> it's more so just to, if we get a wide map like Black Forest to just run around the sides and try and do something. It's probably not going to be very good. Well, here we go. We got Black Forest. Perfect. So we can try it. This is the map I wanted. Uh, so yeah, I can just kind of run around these guys. And, uh, we'll send one up to here. Maybe get him to go around this way. And then go figure out, you know, what's going on here. Maybe just get a shot off every now and then on something. The other guy can just keep going all the way around. Uh... I'll just try and get there, maybe. We'll see what happens. Uh, I don't have any grenade launchers in this one, though. Been spamming your videos to learn this game, and it's helped a ton. Awesome, man. And uh, thanks for that uh, subscription with Prime. I'm a whale... Herrero. I don't even know how to say that, but thanks, man. <laughs> I appreciate that. Uh, Laberlina, thank you for the follow. Uh, the in 1984, thank you also. Let's, uh, let's just get some basic recon for the right. I think our main push needs to be here. I kind of wish we were on this side so that we could just assault this with KDA and overwhelm him. He's playing 8th infantry as well. He's going to have the better stuff around the open. But I feel like I need to go for this. So let's just do like 3 KDA. It's kind of attack on all fronts. Just have fun with it. Do that there, there, there. Got to worry about cobras. I want at least two of you. And uh, I'm still not used to all the sight lines here. That could be a good spot for a little ATGM unit. So we'll just get somebody to go chill out there. Cool. Let's get another off clear. And then one for this side. Now, the only issue is going to be if he does stuff with Cobras, how do we take those out? I guess we just have to use an Osa. So we don't have anything else that's like fast wheeled. So my hand is forced. We'll get the Osa up. Hopefully he doesn't have Ranger Dragons that land there. A recon should at least give us a good idea. And uh, we'll get another one for this side. It's my favorite battle group. Uh, it used to be 119th, but I'm kind of feeling six guards now. Just because it's, uh, just has an interesting play style to it. Favorite for good battle group? Probably something like, uh, 27Y is pretty close up there, in my opinion. Let's see, let's get you and you. Just go chill in there. And I guess that'll kind of be it. Maybe one tank for this far side. With a Bastion missile. Uh, that way we can at least kind of hold him back. 55 points and get another KDA. Perfect. Alright, we'll see how this works. Hopefully my Osas can connect. They have six rounds, so uh, hopefully there's, you know, not more than three helicopters. <laughs> Uh, 
Any tips of building and piloting 8th Infantry Mech? Uh, you need lots of Dragon units, like Mech Rifles Dragons. Those are really good. You want to take all the M1A1 cards. Uh, you want to take both A10 cards. Not the Bomber one, but the uh, AT one. Uh, F-16s are pretty good. They got a speed buff before launch, so they're they're pretty solid now. The LGB one's also pretty good because you get two runs out of it. I just realized I am a melon. I did not start out with a command. Yikes. <laughs> Let's go ahead and correct that. And uh, hopefully that's not a seed. It's not perfect. I'm going to go ahead and buy myself another OSA for this in case this one goes down. I bet that means he has helos. No, surprisingly. Osa? Close. All right. That's acceptable. Okay. Looks like our off clear should make it there. He doesn't get any forward to play either, so like I kind of know I can make that as long as there's not like a helo. Got to route that one weird because he doesn't capture it all the way if you just run straight through. Something I've learned. Uh, let's go ahead and get a helicopter here since we're going to have two Osas in the area. Get one more KDA, one more view. Uh oh. Okay, we need to deal with that quickly. Perfect. That's a nice kill. Okay. Swarm him with all of our KDA units. Go ahead and get one more up. Oh, just barely captured that in time. Okay, we'll move you around like that. Gonna play like this so I can see what else is coming on that other side of the map. And I'm not really worried about him having units right here. I always forget that you can get in this building now. It's actually quite a good building. It would be very good for our Conquerors, actually. Okay, that's a fair amount of stuff. Now we can use our really cheap bomber just to go ahead and hit that. Also have this SPD-9 in the back. That is a Ranger's leader. That's not fantastic. LGB. Let's see, Osos, can you deal with that? No, he just takes out a KDA though. It's a really cheap infantry squad now, so he just can't, he can't deal with the spam. So we should have this in a second. Uh, I've been kind of slacking with the CV micro. Pain. Nice kill by him. Just put you right there. But yeah, we have this. So we don't really have to worry about that anymore. These are in pretty decent positions. Let's get you right there. Go ahead and get another KDA just to sit there. Get a flak SFL so that it can't be seated. And we'll go ahead and order some logistics up there. But yeah, that's fully under our control now. Tokorb is kind of a problem. Let's see if you can hide in the trees. Not quite. At least lets me know what's coming. That's a lot of stuff. 
Yep, no reason to stay in that. Get you over there. I can actually use you up here. Conquerors is coming for this. And this KDA can just go ahead and go in the trees. All right, get myself my last little bastion tank over here. Go and order up another supply. Let's order up a Fleck SFL. Let's get another two sets of KDA through here. Curious how many shots it takes to kill this now. Probably won't even get a shot connection. Might have to go ahead and get a better infantry squad to help out the, the rest of the KDA when they get there. And we'll go ahead and get two tanks here. Start pressuring this next. That's good. This guy like routed all the way back here, but we'll just send him towards the front. Go ahead and get this guy over here. Actually, he'll have Cobras and whatnot, so actually just use you defensively. Switch around the helicopter. Assuming he's probably in that building. It's about time to start getting our artillery. Alright, so we'll be at a plus two permanently. Unless he captures this zone on the right. And, uh... You're going to be used to cross this open field. He shouldn't be able to hit you from there. Let's go and get another cheap ATGM there just to hold that back. Get another recon here. You go resupply the AA. All right, we're getting some little transports there. SPG-9 doing its thing. There we go, two for two. Infantry is almost there. Haven't seen any like big targets yet though. Like all I've really seen on the map is just an F-16, his infantry squad's here, and then like some infantry here. Haven't seen a tank or anything yet. But uh, we'll just keep our foot on the gas. It's going to get three of you. And I'm going to want like some more tanks for you. Oh, that's an ACAV. Nice. This SPG-9 is actually putting in the work right now. M1A3. Uh, 11E Para. Uh, basically take all the infantry with the Apple S. <laughs> I haven't tried them out on the new update, but, uh, I think the Para's Marine is actually probably a... Ooh. Ooh. Hold up. I think the Para's Marine is probably better than the Legionnaire Para's. The only difference is the, uh, Legionnaires get the, uh... What you call it? Uh... It's the red flag trait. What is that trait called? I'm blanking. Resolute trait. Resolute trait. Yeah, they get the resolute trait. Um, but you're paying 10 extra points, basically just for that resolute trait. Let's see if this guy moves his artillery. See if we can crush some dreams here. But you also get tons of cards of the Paris Marine, which is kind of insane. You get like four cards of them or something. All right, uh, I'm going to pull you back. I don't know what happened to this KDA guy. I guess that was the artillery. All right, I'm just going to do a little half salvo. See if we uh, connect on anything. If you see something explode, that means we killed something. Looks like he moved it, though. Yep, it's right here. Alright, Smirch! He's right here! 
That's why I fired a half salvo so he'd think he's safe. So maybe now he doesn't move it. How do you know about this? How did you know that was there? <laughs> Aim yourself. Destroy his artillery. Just need more tanks and stuff here. We have the infantry. We'll have the smoke. It's interesting. Osa. Do we have something to say? It's an LGB plane. All right. As usual, the AA not connecting. Can we please? Can we please do something about this, please? All right, nothing. <laughs> Did we kill his artillery? Does not look like it. Move you right there. So honestly, just go ahead and scout this. I don't think he even has anything here. Yeah, he's just moving around that artillery. Fair enough. I feel like my infantry is... Not doing very well. How do you know that is there? Interesting. Alright, well the book will hopefully help out with the... Uh, I already bought two, but I'm going to buy two more. More of you. I want you. Uh, the book will hopefully help out with the uh, LGB situation. And then we got two Osas over here, so I'm, I'm going to hope that that's enough. <laughs> uh, yeah, I got the smoke here. Right now I'm just kind of probing what he's got first, because I don't think he has infantry here, so I don't think I need the smoke till I'm going for here. Just kind of testing the lines at the moment. Also, I don't want to reveal it because he, he's got that artillery up. Uh, which is just going to come after it. So I'm actually going to have to move my stuff. Alright, well that's firing again. I wonder if that's going for... No, it's going after that, okay. I don't really need smoke, we'll just do that for now. There you go, I'm gonna kill all these fire support units. Where's the new wave? Let's get you guys up. Let's go ahead and I want the napalm already. KDA, KDA's coming, let's go ahead and get another three stack. I'm going to mortar my own guy on accident, so let's change that. Toe 2 is interesting. Not really something I want to fight. And I seem to be lacking a critical component of my push here via uh, anti-air. <laughs> Spread out, please. Don't all die to one toe two hit. Thank you. All right, we got the book in position. Let's uh, hopefully deal with this. And we can quickly rotate this guy over to help deal with the Cobra. Of course, it still doesn't connect. Toe two is kind of a problem. Thank you. We finally get something. He's got a toe Cobra. Let's pull back. Next wave is here. Let's go ahead and get the napalm grid. Alright, go ahead and move you guys. Move you right there. Go ahead and send you up a little bit. Send both of you there. Also, let's see what you can do. Unfortunate.
There we go. Good job. Next wave. I believe I can just outspam him with stuff here. Put you up. He's not going to have good AT either, so I can rely upon that. And I got the Napalm Gred uh, whenever I want to use it. So yeah, let's just keep running him down. Uh, he's coming in with some interesting stuff on this side. We've got to be a little mindful of that. Good thing is we have AT and cluster planes. Still don't need smoke. Can go and unload all this. Send all that forward. That's <laughs> ATGM hell for him. And let's go ahead and run these guys in. Yeah, he's in a rough spot here. He seems to want to stay in the uh, rough spot, though. Right now, he's just uh, basically surrounded by ATGMs everywhere. All right. There we go. Another nice hit. Let's, uh, let's get you up there. Let's go ahead and run you forward. Let's keep moving these KDA. Shoot to the edge, get you up there. Here comes his reinforcements. About to just stack this with some more KDA. He's gonna run out of options here. Get two more tanks up, and uh, let's go ahead and use this Napalm Grad to hit this area. As he just unloaded some stuff there. Keep moving all that forward. Our tanks can now move to support from this position. And uh, CV-wise, let's see, we'll have to figure that out in a minute. Fire a couple shots in here. There we go, now fire there. CV-wise, I guess we'll just get a CV tank or something for here. Uh, this KDH is just gonna go across the front line. Where's that other CV? There he is. Let's go ahead and get you in there. This is kind of interesting. That's also very interesting. Kill one of my tanks with that. Get a helicopter up. All right. You got 12 rounds left. Let's go ahead and hit right there. Maybe that can get rid of his command in this area. It's a tow two more than likely. And uh, we have more infantry that we can send in. Let's see, what is the best target here? Probably the Chaparral. Let's keep advancing with you. Okay, we lost vision. That's quite unfortunate timing. But he should be fully kicked out over here. Uh, this is kind of a problem, though. <laughs> Wasn't really paying attention over here. Looks like he built up all his forces on this side to attack that while we were focused on it over here. Anyways, uh... Hmm. Let's get a command tank for this. Let's keep that going forward. Keep that going forward. Go ahead and launch all of this forward. The helicopters. Ouch. Uh, Got to deal with you before I do anything else. There we go. We dealt with that. Maybe you can uh, somehow kill that M1 there as well. Okay. Yeah, we got this under our control. Just a matter of time. Smirch. Let's, uh, let's just use you to hit that. Why not? 
KDA, great job. Smirch, actually, let's just use you to hit that. Hit that. No. Alright, fine. It's fine by me. Uh, you need to be restocking yourself. Don't have a Malka. All right. Well, that kind of changes things. That's been completely taken, so we no longer need any more infantry there. KDA can move up. Hello, A10. Put you over there. I think I have plenty of KDA in the mid. Don't think I need any more. Okay. Basically, what I want to do is just start investing in my air, and then we can take back that zone over there. Let's keep going, see if we can uh, press all the way to his back zone. That would be quite nice. Okay, looks like we're in. I don't think he has anything there. Do need some more supply here. And uh, Osa. Oh, you're out of ammo. Why are you out of ammo? That would be awesome if we can get a rear shot here. Close. At least got one hit. I see this guy. <laughs> it's up to you, Book. It's up to you. Just going to run away. Yeah, of course, Book can do it. Where are you? There you are. All right. Okay, Flak SFL, you sit there. Put you in this little church tower. All right, we killed that. It took all four shots from the book, but we finally got it. Got to worry about the Doe Cobra. Let's go ahead and get an Osa up, pair it with you. Osa here, let's get up there. Move you guys like that, go ahead and get you across. It's probably an Abrams if I had to guess. Let's just try and run back a little bit. Go ahead and get an AT plane out. See how he wants to deal with that. We finally captured that, so we're at a nice plus six. Not too shabby. Yeah, it's a really fun game. I, I very much enjoy Warno. Most of the divisions feel pretty balanced by now, too. Uh, let's see, where, where is that? It's right here. Let's see if he's gotten lazy with his artillery micro. Uh, I'm just going to hide you, like, back here. Such a beautiful game, too. <laughs> okay. Now, since these are just high HP infantry squads, we're just going to run them out on the open, and hopefully they'll provide us targets for our, uh, our planes. Let's see if we get his artillery. There it is. That's the explosion we were looking for. He got lazy. <laughs> He got lazy with it. Uh, we'll go ahead and get you over there. Sell you. Yeah, eventually the counter battery pays off because your opponent's going to get lazy with the micro. It's worth it to keep it up. Uh, okay. Well, LGB plan. That guy's bailed out. So I go repair him. Hmm. Perhaps a bomber could be useful here. Maybe two. Just leave the book down there. Well, 
Well, that was a good strike. Is that other ranger squad somewhere around here? Uh, we kind of hit him. A little bit of a miss, a little bit of a hit. Uh, he is contesting this zone again. It's just a little bit problematic. Still at a nice plus four. Our napalm grad is almost reloaded. Here comes the Cobra again. Let's just use the uh, cluster to deal with that. We also have the Osa in the area. KDA okay, can just keep marching forward. Might as well just move this CV over here. Oh, hello. That just fire from there? Yes, it did. All right, Cluster, you have a new target. Here he comes. And he's dead. <laughs> Got his other paladin. All right, let's get the rest of these bombers up. That's a CV trying to get to there. Oh, we just killed his other command, I guess. See, so yeah, we'll be at a plus six again, and he surrenders. Nice. Interesting.